Nationals hosting the Astros, and the Astros are minus 176 on the money line. The Nationals are plus 148, over under nine runs. The Astros laying a run and a half on the run line are minus 106, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win by two or more. And the Nationals getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 113, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. It's supposed to be Verlander in his first start of the year versus Gore. Verlander did pitch against the Nationals last year as a member of the Mets. Five and a third, one run, one earned. They won that game five to two, and he struck out five. And then for Gore, five and two thirds, no runs, no earned. They won that game four to one, and he struck out four. Head to head, the Astros are six and four. The road team, seven and three. The favorite is five and five on the money line. The underdog getting a run and a half on the run line is six and four. There's only been one one run game in their last 10. The over is five, four, and one, and the under nine is six, one, and three. For the Astros, they are on a three game losing streak. They are one and three in their last four. 13 runs, seven runs, eight runs, nine runs. Eight runs and a win, one run and a loss, two runs and a loss, four runs and a loss. For the Nationals, they're traveling back from the West Coast. They're six and four in their last 10. The under is seven and three in their last 10, and they're two and two in their last four. 13 runs, 10 runs, 8 runs, 2 runs, 6 runs and a loss, 6 runs and a win, 2 runs and a loss, 2 runs and a win. I'm going to give the Astros the edge here. I just think that they can out-hit the Nationals. I'm going to take the Astros with the money line. I will take the Nationals getting the runs, and I'm going to go under. Both of these pitchers pitched extremely well against the opposing team last year, so we'll see if this is a pitcher's duel, and then the bullpen ultimately screws it up. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.